Welcome back. The Federation of State Beef Councils is made up of the 45 qualified state beef councils that collect the $1 per head beef checkoff. And this year, they're celebrating 50 years. We recently had the chance to talk to some of its members about this special milestone. Our forefathers who put this together were a genius. Uh, you know, this is a complicated structure, uh, but it's a very important structure. And I think what it does, it gives the grassroots producer a say-so in what they're doing with their checkoff dollars. The guys that started this were so visionary to see what we needed. Um, and I've been around for not all the 50 years, but several of them, and watched the state, the Federation of State Beef Councils evolve from the Beef Industry Council, the National Livestock and Meat Board, to where we are now taking a more bold role in, um, in doing the checkoff work. And it's just, um, it's just a, a self-help program that works like no other I've been involved with. The Federation of State Beef Councils is um, the checkoff division of NCBA. And together, we've been the feet on the streets of State Beef Councils to help extend the great programs that have been delivered on behalf of America's beef producers um, over the last 50 years. It started even longer ago than that. And State Beef Councils were getting organized in the 1950s and uh, developing programs in their own states and then, then came together in 1963 to, to really form that coalition that would, that would create a national program. And it, it's just come, come a long way in those 50 years. But really the idea is still exactly the same and that is that uh, we can really uh, be strong as individual states in what we do, but once we join our forces, we can be even stronger, and I think that's really a great message. When we have a strong national program, we have a strong state program, and when we have a st strong state program, then we have a strong national program, and they work so well together, and they need each other. But it, it brings all of the states together, and the, the state beef councils, or the state checkoff programs, uh, are different, the states have different structures, but we all come together to uh, help drive beef demand. And, and it's a uh, excellent, the Federation brings the state national groups together with the, the one purpose. We all have different situations in our individual states, but um, there's always those things that we share and we can take from others and use in our own states. And that sort of brings in the idea of efficiency um, because when we can all uh, share our ideas um, and the national works with us, um, it makes a very efficient organization. Without our beef councils, our national programs really can't extend and do all that they're meant to do. That we really need the beef councils because they are the ones that are getting into the stores, they're the ones that are getting into the restaurants, they're the ones that have the relationships. Uh, with those consumers and those school districts and those um, outlets for the product and so we desperately need to have a relationship with beef councils to make a difference for beef demand. I have a very small staff, it's me and a part-timer and neither one of us is a designer and so we, we utilize design services an awful lot and um, usually on short notice and they're very cooperative with us and very helpful. We use them for ads, we use them for brochures, um, any types of publications and sometimes even to help us with um, radio advertisements, newsletters, I, I, we, we keep them busy. One of the services that we just used recently was design services and we make a, a great benefit out of that. We just, uh, they designed a BQA brochure for us that looks really great, very professional and it's something that in New York State with a limited budget we couldn't afford a de uh, graphic designer to do that and so that was one of the most recent uses of the Federation services. One of the things that is great about the Federation is states like Wyoming with a small staff and lots of cattle but no people, we can take those dollars and we can invest them well in places where the consumers live and really utilize producer dollars to make the biggest impact on beef demand. It's been a great state national partnership uh, moving the dollars to where the people are, and that's what I'm most proud of. I really feel like uh, we have had some visionary people that have got us to this point in the industry. Um, 
you know, there's a lot of there's a lot of issues, frankly, that we're kind of dealing with, and I think it, it we're going to be able to deal with those better. Uh, with this state and national partnership and so when I think about the last 50 years I think it's been very valuable to have um, a group of a, a team if you will that all works for one goal. Happy anniversary Federation of State Beef Councils we are a big fan um, of the work that we've been able to accomplish together. Happy 50th anniversary. It's a true reason to celebrate 50 years of collaborative efforts that have been successful in assisting this industry in staying relevant and I, I can't think of a greater reason to celebrate. Oh happy anniversary. I'm delighted to be a part of this.